Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up MIDI remap inside Logic. It's a little bit different than in all the other DAWs because Logic has a special feature called MIDI effects, which is absolutely perfect for using something like MIDI remap. Let's dive into it. So I have this drum track uh, currently using Easy Drummer. And the old problem, if I want to use something like Gecko Drums Architect, it's not going to work. So go to the track with the library you want to use and go to the slot above the instruments where it says MIDI effects. And there under audio units, my name should show up, Mohan Klein, and then my plugin MIDI Remap. Then choose the source library, meaning the library that you programmed the drums with or in, with their mapping. In this case, it's going to be Tune Track Easy Drummer. I want to use it with Get Good Drums Architects. So now let's listen to it again. Works. Easy peasy. So if you don't want to change anything MIDI Remap does for you, you already done it, it's easy as that. But if you want to fully unlock the potential of the new library, meaning other symbols or stuff like that, and you want to proceed programming your drums with the new library, uh, you might want to transfer the current drums to the new drum track, which will give you full control over every note you already programmed, but with the new library. So here's how to set that up in Logic. So in Logic, this advanced usage of MIDI Remap is a bit different than in all the other DAWs. Um, first thing you need to do is a one-time thing to check. Um, go to your audio MIDI setup. If you don't know where that is, type command and space, or simply go to applications, utilities, audio MIDI setup. Audio MIDI setup. That app is from Apple and comes with macOS. So go to Window, Show MIDI Studio. And the only thing you need to check is IAC driver. Make sure that Devices Online is checked. That's it. This is a one-time thing, and most of the time, this is already checked by default coming with a new MacBook. So now, this time, we're going to use the other approach. We're going to do a little different setup. So the drums need to be in the track that they were programmed with. In this case, that's the Easy Drummer track. The other track doesn't need MIDI room anymore. So this is our starting point. So now we're going to add MIDI Remap to the Easy Drama track. Go to MIDI FX and again, choose my plugin, this time on the Easy Drama track, and choose the same presets from Easy Drama to <clears throat> Architect. And now we're going to replace the current library, which is Easy Drama in this case, with a plugin that comes with Logic by default. Uh, just go to Utility, External Instrument, and then it doesn't matter if you choose Mono or Stereo because we're handling MIDI, but I'm going for Stereo. Just choose IAC driver you just activated or which already was activated as your MIDI destination, and then you want to check Auto Compensate Latency. That's it. The only thing we need to do now is go to our new library track, in this case Architects, and enable Monitoring. Same result, but here's the difference. Uh, you can now record the remap drums to the new track. And you can get rid of all the other stuff and you have new and fresh, clean remapped drums on your new library's track and can do all the stuff you want to do with it. So that's probably all you need to know on how to use MIDI Remap and unlock the full potential and all its magic um, inside Logic. Currently, there is a known bug inside Logic with MIDIFX, uh, which Apple is aware of, which results in a note randomly playing if you activate or deactivate a plugin or if you start playback. It happens sometimes, it doesn't happen too often. It's a known bug, it's not a big deal. It's gonna be fixed. So just don't wonder if you ever hear random notes when you start playback or if you activate or deactivate a MIDI effects. Um, that's normal at, the, at this point in time. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video and check out Logic and MIDI Room, it's gonna make your life awesome.